Some people believe that the moon landings were hoaxed because when they look at the photos they will see that there are no stars in the sky and they expect them to be bright and twinkling. Some say that they were removed because astronomers would have worked out that they weren't really on the moon but on some kind of sound stage. But if you think about the problem of lack of stars in the sky, it's related to a mistake people make when they photograph people, let's say against a window or a doorway, in this case a window. They will expose it nicely for the outside world, but because of this, the person they're really photographing, as in this example, is in shadow. This is a problem of exposure. So we're going to do an experiment with a pot plant and exposure to illustrate this problem. If you look at the plant from this side, the exposure for it is correct. But if we move around to here, then our exposure is more correct for the white of the building outside, which is more light coming into the camera. And you'll notice that the plant is more darker and therefore it is more difficult to see any detail in the plant due to the exposure issue. The problem on the moon's surface was that the stars were just too faint to be seen because they had to expose the cameras so that they could be exposed correctly to pick up the astronauts and the lunar surface which were very bright and reflective. People don't realize how bright the moon is, brightest object in the night sky. This picture took a fiftieth of a second. This picture took a ninetieth of a second to take. Whereas if you're photographing something faint like stars, for instance the Hubble Deep Field, this took hundreds of hours in order to photograph these galaxies. So that is why on the moon the pictures in the sky will not show stars. They're just too faint in, to show up because they were exposed for the lunar landscape and the astronauts at the time.